guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time watching me, hello, my name is Carly. I make home videos and fashion videos. So if you like home decor videos or room makeovers and room transformation, you should subscribe to my channel. I'll put the link down below on your screen. You can hit the subscribe button or you can click in the info so you never miss a video. I'm filming in a new spot today, guys. Welcome to my brand new office. If this is your first time watching me, you might be thinking to yourself, why does she need an office? I'm glad you asked, little Timmy. Editing videos alone takes me around seven to eight hours, so if I'm going to be in here for that long, I really wanted to enjoy my space, unless it's one of those days where I'm sitting on my couch in sweatpants. But most of the days, I like to get dressed and act like I'm a functioning, working human. It's a really important business call. So glad I have this office. So the first thing I actually bought for this office was this rug, and this rug is by Shabby Chic Couture. I felt like this rug is my loft in a rug. It's muted gray, it's got shades of like silver and cream, and then there's metallic silver dots throughout the whole thing, so when the light hits it, it's very reflective, but when there's light not hitting it, it almost looks like it blends into the floor. I want to say that it's understated, but it's a metallic fur throw. It's a very simple understated metallic fur throw. My desk is from West Elm and it's this clear glass top and the top is separate from the base and the base is just these reflective legs and I like that this kind of looks like it's an artist table instead of a traditional desk. I like that it's kind of like bare bone and minimal, there's not a lot of drawers on it. I like that it was glass because it keeps the space looking open and airy and it's not this heavy presence in the room because it is a smaller space so I wanted to keep it looking light and open. The desk took the longest out of everything in this room to get here because UPS lost the top of the desk. What can Brown do for you? I cannot lose my stuff. You can do that for me, Brown. It was like the emperor's new desk, basically, because I just had legs. So when people would come over, I'd be like, don't you like my new desk? And they'd be like, and I'd be like, it's right there. You can't see it. My desk chair is this white quilted chair from Z Gallery. My chairs in my dining room are black quilted, so I felt like this tied in really nicely across the spaces. This is a real office chair. Like It's got wheels. It's got like gear shifters. I can lock it. I don't know how to lock it, but I can do it. The feature's there. Behind me, I just hung up these mirror mosaics from Pier 1. I bought the same mosaic and just hung it twice like a diptych, so it would frame the desk chair. So across from my desk, I wanted a little seating area because one, it looks super cute, let's just be honest. But also because I do a lot of photography work in my loft, so I just figured having the seating area would be really nice because I could just turn my computer and then we could collaborate on the project together. So these chairs are from Ikea. I bought two of their clear acrylic chairs. Over them, I just have these kind of like faux fur throws and Ikea had them. These ones are from a online boutique called Shop Rachel George. Behind the seating area, I just have my Hayworth dresser from Pier 1. This used to be a dresser for my clothing when it was in my bedroom. I just have a light on it, I have my Prada Marfa sign, and then I have a printer. I've literally never used that printer. It's just there for show. I'm sure it works, I just don't know how to work it. Maybe I'll be a real grown up someday. On my desk, I just have my iMac computer, and mine is super old. In case you're wondering, like, yeah, why is that so thick? It's because it's old AF, my friend. For my mouse pad, I just have a magazine. I always have this little short stack of hydrangeas in a square vase, and then I have the flowers on top of this tray, and I think this is actually a serving tray, but I decided to use it on my desk, and this is kind of like a crystal quartz serving tray with silver around the edge. It's really, really cool. It kind of looks like it's almost a tree stump. And then the only other thing of decoration on my desk is this candle from Diptyque. All right guys, that was it for my home office reveal. If you like home videos and room inspiration, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I'll link it down below on the screen or in the info bar. I post new videos every single Thursday and I'm constantly posting room tours, home inspiration, and makeover videos. So if you want to see them, make sure to subscribe. And also follow me on Instagram. My username is Carly Christman and I post preview pictures and inspiration photos and room makeovers on my Instagram account. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next Thursday. Bye. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up to let me know that you like room makeover videos and home tours. Also, make sure to leave me a comment down below letting me know what your favorite part of the video was and I'll see you next week. Bye.